In this series of Flutter app bars, we are going to be learning how we can customize it in various different ways. How we can add gradient to our app bar, increase its height, give it any shape we want, add image backgrounds to it, and much more. So make sure to check all the videos in the playlist. So what about extending our app bars? It doesn't look great to every time use a rectangular app bar with a fixed size, isn't it? So in the name of all UI lovers, let's get started has solutions for every type of customizations. So goes for the extended app bars. We have two ways for extending our app bars. First let us see by bottom property. So this was our previous gradient app bar. Let us use bottom in this. Bottom takes a preferred size widget. Let's give a preferred size to it. Parameter preferred size which takes many Options. Let's choose size dot from height. It increases the size of app bar from height. So let's try and run it. Our emulator appears red, which means an error. So this error is because preferred size child can't be null. We have to give a child to it. Let's give a size box for now with a height maybe 200. And let's run it. So it appears an extended app bar. So size dot from height means that after a fixed size of app bar, it increases the height by 200. This is the one way of making a extended app bar. We can give child text to it. It appears at the end of the app bar. We can try and go on adding more children to test. I'll increase the app bar. We can add column. We can add a raised button to it. Let's try size dot from radius. Most probably it will give an error. Oh, it's a bottom overflow. So let's keep it sized out from height only. Or no, no, just wait. Let's try size out from width once. We give an error. Yeah, it shows an error. Because app bar already covers whole width in this case. So let us keep size out from height only now. Let us try this bottom opacity method. Yeah, it takes value from 0 to 1. Let's give 0.5. Yeah, it makes bottom somewhat blur. Now let's discuss the second method of adding a preferred size to it. We can also wrap the app bar in preferred size and give the preferred size above it. So see it's giving almost the same result. But this time size dot from height is not from fixed height of app bar, it is from the top. We have this property in scaffold extend body behind app bar from this. The body appears from the top of the app bar, which is hidden behind the app bar. If we set it to false, then body starts from after the app bar finishes see now this yellow color is also behind the app bar let's try and give shape to the extended app bar So see it gives a beautiful rounded edges at the bottom of the app bar. That's all for the extension of app bars. Rest all the properties are same. You can give gradients, shapes, sizes, text, widgets, actions, leading, all are same. You can give all of them to this extended app bars. This is the code for extended app bar the final code the gradient app bar and 
this is the second way of adding increased jab bar so that's all subscribe our channel careless coders for more such content and stay tuned thank you